Hey there and welcome to Japan Online. Well, something that is is gaining popularity is dog runs. Um, these are where you can take a dog and let them run around. You know, because um, in Japan you don't really let your dog run around the backyard or, you know, around the streets or take them to a local park and let them run around because it's sort of frowned upon, you know, here in Japan. But if you want to, you can take the you take your dogs to this place here. It's fenced off and they have lots of obstacles and things that they can jump around on and whatnot. But the funny thing is, is that these ones that I've seen, or the ones that I normally see, tend to be uh, on expressways in service areas. So it's a paid road that you're probably traveling from maybe your hometown to Tokyo or on the way back and you need a rest, so you stop in a service area. And what, you've got a little place here to take your dog and let them have a bit of a run around, a bit of a rest. Um, so yeah, they're becoming more and more popular here. Um, like I said, I haven't really seen them uh, in say the local cities or anything like that they tend to be uh, in service areas on the uh, the Tome or whatever expressways uh, throughout Japan and of course uh, they have uh, other things like here we have a dog calf or a pet calf what do you want to call it where uh, you can take your uh, dogs in with you and sit down and have a cup of coffee or tea whatever and sorry about the shaky video there uh, and usually there's a dog run or a dog uh, place to take your dog and let them run around at the back uh, this one here is a, a it's called pet paradise by the looks of it and you can take them in there have a coffee buy stuff for them like clothing leashes dog food or whatever and then let them have a bit of a run around while you just relax and drink coffee drink tea whatever um, knowing that your dog's getting a good long rest um, before you get back into the car and continue on your journey but so, yeah, they're becoming more and more popular. Um, and what's actually funny is this one here, they have, the, um, and I'll show you a video soon, is they have a little uh, uh, little photo booth that you can, you and your dog or you and your pet can sort of stand there and get some photos. Um, you've seen them, in, you've probably seen them in game centers. Um, here it is, and uh, but this one here is for you and your dog, and you can, I guess, put little, draw little characters on it and whatnot, and then get printouts and put them on your phone and wherever, whatever. So it's quite interesting. Kicking box. But anyway, thought you might enjoy that. Anyway, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed that. And uh, if you haven't already, click on the subscribe button and receive update and subscribe to this channel, I should say, and you'll receive updates to when we post videos to YouTube. To the left there, we have um, the Hamamatsu Air Festa. Uh, or Air Festival, um, we have a, uh, an Air Force base in Hamamatsu, so they each year they have, uh, around about this time, have a bit of a festival of all the planes and helicopters and whatnot, and to the left there is um, a bit of a, a tour around um, uh, a Japanese uh, hotel room, um, a traditional Japanese hotel room, not the typical business one, but uh, a, a traditional one. So check out those two videos, and of course if you do like the videos, please like, Leave a comment. Let us know your experience uh, and or your if your opinion on these videos. And of course, if uh, please do share the videos with your family and friends on Facebook, Twitter, or wherever. We really, really do appreciate your support for uh, the videos and this channel. But anyway, thank you for watching, and keep an eye out for more videos coming soon. Later.